going on everybody? My name is Chris and I'm going to go ahead and show you guys a tour of my room. I'm staying over here at the Kalahari over in Sandusky, Ohio. Yep, it's right off of Lake Erie, Cedar Point, all that kind of stuff. So if you guys are looking for a cool hotel with a lot of space, this might be the room for you. So I'm going to go ahead and give you a tour before I make everything all dirty. So, front door, obviously. And uh, alright, so here is a big old counter space. You have a single sink. A lot of detail in these rooms, right? So I think these are themed in Africa. Obviously no smoking, no pets. They do have a lot of uh, signs throughout the room for children because this is a big amusement park kind of thing since it's a big indoor water park. It's one of the biggest in the nation. Um, looks like our bathroom. Let's see, there we go. Again, back on to the detailing. Got a nice tile. <clears throat> Looks like a jet for a spa. That's pretty cool. Definitely nice. You got your sets of shower and conditioner, shampoo. So nice. You can take a bath, take a shower, take a spa. Obviously, the toilet. All right. And onward. Okay, a little storage space. Now the whole reason that I'm actually in this hotel is I'm on, a, on travel for business. And the biggest thing is if you're staying somewhere for a month, you want somewhere with a kitchen and this is exactly what we wanted. So we'll be able to cook and we're not living out of a mini fridge because it's a lot harder to shop and kind of eat a lot cleaner, you know what I mean? So now I'll be able to cook my breakfast, cook my dinners, things like that and have a lot more space to kind of live for a full month. So let's go ahead and show you guys the kitchen. The nice old lion on the wall. <laughs> this actually feels real. Right, I'm not too, not entirely sure. Um, but yeah, so here's the island. It comes with three bar stools. You actually have a dishwasher, microwave, and an oven. Everything seems pretty clean in here. Comes with soap, everything you need so far. Coffee maker for your early mornings if you're a coffee drinker. I personally am not. And uh, yeah, you get a couple bowls, got some cups, plates. Everything looks ready to go. You even have a toaster. You have stuff to cut up with. Yeah, so looks pretty good so far. All right, check out the fridge. I always like to see if they have anything in there complimentary from the hotel. Usually they'll leave like waters or something. Yeah, pretty empty. Pretty standard of a fridge, which is all that we obviously need if you're on vacation. All right, nice little big dinner table. So we got what, how many chairs? We got one, two, three, four, five, six. Six chairs on a roundabout. Nice little painting over here. Go along with this light. Um, that's just a door to the other rooms. Here is your thermostat. And uh, looks like a king, king size bed. And in here you have a TV. Nice little painting. Uh, and two little nightstands. <clears throat> but look at this guy. It looks like we got some kind of a buffalo, elephant, and a rhino. So it goes back into the unique little designs in this room. Quick tip too, if you ever go into a hotel, go ahead and check, check the drawers. You never know what you'll find. Like right now, I'm looking at a Bible. So someone left their Bible or maybe it belongs to the hotel, I'm not sure. Sometimes you'll find money, you'll find crazy stuff. But <clears throat> the rest of them are empty. And looks like we have one other little thing in here, which is a little closet. So you throw some suits in there or whatever. And here is the view from the third floor. So here's the patio. Looks like you have a couple seats over here to overlook. And then right down below over there, that's the outdoor pool, which is obviously gonna be closed because it's still, I mean, I'm here in January for those of you who's gonna watch this video later on. So in January, you might not wanna go swimming outside. 
All right, so back out here to the main area. Nice little storage area right here. Throw some stuff on there. <clears throat> Mirror. All right, you have two sofas here. I actually really like the uh, the painting up on the wall. A little TV, I don't know what size that would be. If I were a bedding man, I'd probably say like 50 inch TV or something. You got a fireplace. And uh, that is a real fire, so that's pretty cool. Let me go ahead and show you. It's a real fire in there. Giving off a little bit of heat. Nice during the winter. And um, there's a better look of that pool I was talking to you guys about. So I don't know if that's permanently closed or anything. It's probably just for the winter season. But it definitely looks big. Nice little cheetah on the wall. And um, that's about it. So I must say, uh, I was actually at the Kalahari all last week, but I wasn't in I wasn't in one of these big uh, what do they call these? I wasn't in one of these lodge rooms. I was in a hut, and the hut's a basic standard room. It's got the two twin size beds. It has a mini fridge, bathroom, shower, and that's pretty much it. It was it had a tub in there, and um, yeah, it's pretty much like this room because this room's kind of very similar. Very dim, expect, to, expect your room to be very dim if you stay in the hut. But if you have a big family or you have a party or something going on like that, you have multiple people or you're extending your stay, definitely check this out because uh, this is probably one of the nicest rooms I've stayed in <laughs> in my whole 26 years of life. <laughs> so uh, yeah, it has everything I need. It has the kitchen, has a nice little living area, a bedroom, and uh, if I want to come outside during the holiday or during the nicer, warmer, months we can go ahead and do that as well but uh yeah i'm actually pretty stoked about being here for the rest of the time i can actually unpack get cooking get cooking and things of that nature and as i was talking i actually found a little thermostat for the uh for the fireplace so that's pretty cool but yeah that's about to do it for this little tour this little wrap around quick walk around of the rooms if you guys have any questions about it Leave it down in my comments below and I will try to address them for you. Until next time, I want to say never live your life on idle and I will see you guys in the next one. Peace. Another thing is, odds are, if you're staying in a hotel like this, you're probably here for the water park in all reality. Um, so, if you're a theme park junkie and you guys follow Disney, maybe you know what a hidden Mickey is, where uh, Disney kind of hides little hidden Mickey ears. You got the face and the two circles. I think they have a little hidden elephant in here. So, let's address that elephant in the room. <laughs> so, it's pretty cool, right? That little elephant and towel. Um, just figured I'd show you guys that. I thought that was kind of neat and unique.